day. Money, power, respect. Three the hard way. Back to Three the Hard Way TV with the beautiful Catherine. Diana, who is lost in her phone, <laughs> and my uncle Derek came through hey. to uh, you know, What's get up? a show some motherfucking uh, some of that OG status, man. What's up? Um, on today's show, the question is, y'all got any questions for us? That email is below. Is marriage and relationships foreign now? I swear it seems. Extinct. Anything that requires any type of loyalty, trust, honesty, and commitment. All I see and hear about is situation chips. Is it over for relationships and marriage? Oh, there's a lot of hoes getting married. That's weird. Oh, we love you. It's most definitely a lot of a lot of hoes get married. I know I know I know two hoes that recently got married but they got married to two suck ass niggas and I know them too so you know I know like what was going on. I mean it sounds like I'm like no they the, the niggas two niggas were suckers and the two chicks they married were whores. I mean I mean I, I don't know if you know them guys I wouldn't categorize them as suckers because you know at some point you have, you know when you come across a woman she brings something to the table right everybody gonna uh no nah, these niggas were suckers like they at work, the bitch riding around with another <laughs> nigga in their car. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shit. They, things of that nature. So, yeah, them, they were suckers. You know what I'm saying? Okay. It's like one of the niggas, he married a bitch that the fuck. They work together. She fucked at least 15, 20 niggas right, right. in the same job. But you the nigga that made her your wife. That have what, what did that pussy do that the mother 19 niggas? Didn't see. You got another head now like that. Loose? <laughs> <laughs> you just took a head, cousin. No, you hey. No, you just had it loose. You had it. You I, came in on no fucking stage. Hey, hey, I, I didn't touch him. Okay. I mean, maybe he was excited about, about what he was going to get, you know. She experienced. You want to see your host? She experienced. Oh, right? old buzzer. <laughs> she, she about 49. At least she know what she's doing, right? She about 49. He about 34. <laughs> well, why would you do it to yourself? Damn. They say experience is the best teacher. I'm trying to. Like and they also say you can't teach your old dog new tricks. <laughs> right, so you want the old like tricks you already know. <laughs> you don't want no new tricks because you don't want to teach nobody new. Yeah, you don't want nobody you have to teach her. You want somebody yeah. already experienced. Yeah. So she has some horse uh, tendencies then. Hey, she did some shit. She never had. He was like, you know, I got to lock this down. <laughs> <laughs> you can have any nigga you want. Is she old as hell, she getting close to that pension. But is she black? Because you know, we age differently. Nah, you she, hear me? Nah, she aged horribly. So, so I mean, so would you like to get with a woman you have to teach her something or do you want her to come and experience already? I want a woman with both <laughs> experience and let me teach her. Because that way I could be experienced and she could teach me something you know, too. Okay. I think what I hate the most is like, you know, niggas that make that statement and shit, like dudes that make that statement on screen and don't know shit. Not saying that's you cousin, but... No, nah, I just said, I wanna, I know some things, but I, I can also be taught. When you close your mind and feel like can't nobody teach you nothing, okay. you well, fucked up. I mean, so, so right. you know, you go fill out a job application, they, you know, sometimes they say, you know, no experience necessary, you know, you must have five, ten years of experience. So, right. you know, you get in a relationship, you know, do you want the woman coming in with some experience? Well, you have to teach right. her everything from the ground up, right? No, I don't want no ball tires. <laughs> <laughs> if, I go, if I go back, I, I want the tires to be ball. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I think, um, I think that a relationship marriage is not a foreign um, concept. I don't think that it's something that people, I just, I believe that everybody need fucking help out here. That's what people looking for. And a lot of people we ain't got time for that bullshit. Everybody ain't trying to look and take care of no grown ass people. Nobody look for that. You gotta be coming with something. You gotta come with something. Even if you don't have nothing, you gotta be working towards it. Then who the fuck wanna be with somebody? Obviously, if you're not, if you not in a relationship or like dating or whatever, because it ain't a situation or a situation. It's not, it's more about that. If you're not compatible with somebody, if a motherfucker ain't trying to bring at least 110%, 
It's a waste of fucking time and energy. They ain't gonna never bring it. It's, it's a lot of it's a lot of situations out here. Well, I mean, you, you, you got you boring. you sometimes you got two people where they both making good money and they just stay together because they comfortable living a lifestyle. And people don't want to get married neither. Too for the simple fact that nobody when you get divorced they take <laughs> half what you got. You got to pay that ass out of them. I'm telling you, I'm doing like first 48 about like killing my husband or my wife. Yeah, I mean, I, I think the reason why you got a lot of situations <laughs> is because when people get married, you expect something different, right? Or, you know, now you're my wife. Nigga, why? Stop being nasty. Nigga, why? You get freaking nasty. Now you want to be a lady. No, just keep reading the nasty, bitch. <laughs> Did all this freakiness with everybody else, threesomes and all that stuff. Then now I'm the one who got to, uh, you know, be on the back burner. No, don't hey, stop being nasty. I'm gonna give you the short end of the stick. Don't change me. But niggas do that too. Dudes do that to make it comfortable. You know what I mean? Dudes do that to be comfortable. You know what I'm saying? Like, not with the nasty shit, because that's like, but you know what I'm saying? Just get comfortable. No, I'm talking about the, the nasty just popping and twisting and all that. Oh, okay. Pop and okay. twist with me. Don't stop popping and twisting. Popping and twist? Yeah, okay. popping and twist. You know, break yeah. it down for me now. Yeah, don't break it down. Don't, don't, don't talk about you got a headache. Damn. Yeah, do the shit you've been doing. I, I agree 100%. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. So, Diana. Is marriage and relationships form instead of is that a thing of the past? Is everybody just out here free dating doing whatever the fuck they want to do? Hold on, you guys. I'm a faithful man. Hold on, hold on. Let me sit down for this. Let me get to out. You know how I feel about marriage. You already know this. I don't believe in marriage. Well, I've been for like seven years since then. It's like you know, I was legally bound there. So I don't believe in marriage. But what I'm saying not, is not Illinois. Damn, you know that, huh? Mm-hmm. Ain't so no, ain't no, is, ain't no uh, common law in the north. That's bad. So my thing is this, like, I don't believe in marriage only because I know that most marriages end in divorce. I can prove it out. 50%? 50% is a Is the glass half full or is it half empty? It's half motherfucking empty. <laughs> <laughs> my thing is this, like, a situation ship is where you're unhappy and he's unhappy. I'm not going to be unhappy for a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna be. I, I don't believe in what is it called? Situationship. Situationship. I don't believe in none of that either. What I believe in is you do you, I do me, we do each other. Cause that's it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I believe in happiness. You guys believe in situationships, marriage. Somebody gonna get too many feelings. Some I, you know, you you doing him and he doing her and then. Whoa. Y'all, I'm just saying. I'm, two, I'm, that's a one plus one equals two. But you just said right. you do right. you, he right. do him, and we right. do each other. Together, okay. No, yeah. you just made it seem like y'all was living you two home. separate no, lives outside of y'all life. Let me clarify. When I say you do you, I do me. That means we sleeping together, and everything else is extra. You're not. That's a relationship. That's a relationship. So, I mean, off of people, I believe in relationship off of penis. So when I say that, I mean to say the Ooh, penis. Like sister. Yes, off the penis. Sister. I can't remember the man, but I can remember that they got their penis. You know what I'm <laughs> I identify you baby penis. Now, what I'm saying by this is that you may go out and you may casually, you might find the love of your life. I think my sister's a whore. That's the person. That's the person that's, that's the representation of the body, the soul. But the penis is a whole different person, just like the vagina. So think about it this way. You know how men go out and cheat on a woman all the time, cousin? You know this because you do it a lot. No. Oh, ho, oh, ho, oh, ho. Oh. Cut, 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 Exactly. Hey, that was My thing shit. is this, you know, it's the difference. You can love somebody emotionally, mentally, or sexually. Or you can get all three. You can get the trifecta. We don't need the trifecta. You know what I'm saying? You can't do those separately, I don't think. Y'all can't well, love you somebody can't like I can, I can enjoy. If a motherfucker giving you somebody. good enough sex, you gonna fall in love. Right, thank you. Cause they, oh shit. shit. I don't have like a dude to be in the house. You won't fall in 
love. Like, like, but that motherfucker was like, Lord Jesus. Cause if a, if a motherfucker <laughs> stroking that motherfucker the right way and he hit you with the I love you, you gonna say, <laughs> I love you too. <laughs> I love you doing sex <laughs> Don't you bust that nut, okay? Because I might not love you no more. So would you say he love you, shit? You, you got baby number six on the way. Shit, don't you listen to the idea of a motherfucker having you motherfuckers in their feelings, okay? My thing is this. Like, if you, if, to me, it's like this. A situation ship is where you're unhappy. A relationship is where you're trying to build happiness. A marriage is where you're supposed to have happiness. But what I have... What Everybody's not going to be happy 100% of the time. No, you can not, be you can be married, be married to somebody for 30 years. Ups and downs going to come. Right. At the first sign you of struggle, you can't up. run from that That's shit. That's building up on the happiness. I don't have time for that. I'm my dad tomorrow. Well, well I mean, if I'm looking at your phone and it's about to die. So your phone needs some attention. So if you don't give your phone no attention, then you're going to have to plug it up. So if yes. you're in a relationship or you're married, you think you're just supposed to get married and not give that person no attention? Exactly. No, I'm saying you give that person for people who want to get married, but I don't want to get married because I don't have attention to get. Well, if you, if you, if you, if you let a nigga uh, put his dick up, then you might well be your That's wife. Then you might well be his wife. Okay, because first of all, first of all, penis is heaven on that. No. <laughs> yes, they, yes, they do. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> But definitely pieces have names, they have shit attached to them. And I feel, I feel like this. I guess, I guess my thing with marriage or a relationship is that fuck. I don't want to have to come out any money or no chocolate choosing the wrong motherfucker. Pink that Kevin is something I don't want to so, do. We all choose the wrong motherfucker all the time. For How many wrong motherfuckers you done ran across in your life? Two. <laughs> So, so let me, yeah, two. So, and you already on that honey right now. And that's because <laughs> they, they got you pregnant. That's why, you know, like, damn, okay. <laughs> I'm just saying. This is so, this is Hey, okay. where's my glasses? Um, who's my right glasses? now? I am, I'm older, I'm mature, I know what I want. And I'm, I'm careful where I, I fucking select. Like, you know, but if I marry somebody, I definitely need So to what you really it. saying is you just on birth control. Do you love me? I definitely want to know I'm definitely one of those. I just want to know. And so, I am on birth control, thank you. You know, so when women but say some, um, the right man, what does that mean, the right man? Well, it's not the right man because you got to be able to. I always penis. say the right penis cousin. Okay. <laughs> 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 to to like you don't. Penis. You don't. You don't count, right? right. Catherine, yeah. what's the right man? Goddamn it. Yes, right. I guess. Right the penis. right man. Well, penis. Uh, that dick shit is just so great because I can teach you niggas some shit. You know, I, I can't like, teach you niggas shit. shit work. You need to come with that shit. I don't teach you to cry out of drafts. <laughs> <laughs> So and that's why our car is still in the shop. So you said that. That's just selection. It's only a selection of penis. Fuck that. So I you said know. that, Cuz said that if she ever went in a relationship with a man, if he tripped down the stairs or some motherfucker, well, he get paralyzed and weighed down, it's over with for the man anyway. Right. He can definitely still get paralyzed. So you, you don't want relationship, you want relationship. Yeah, because you know what? Exactly. I'm going to need, I'm gonna need, but I'm gonna need the stroke. In the head, okay, you guys don't listen to these motherfuckers. These motherfuckers. Are you don't. So you don't want a relationship. You just want relations. No, 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 no. I never said that. The one thing when you talk about penis and things about penis is just make me think that I'm up with cutting right. I mean, I don't want to like, down like, like, the penis. Fucking double juggle that shit. I don't want to down the penis. Around your mouth in your vagina. The penis is not important. The penis is not eight percent. Somebody well, come. You got to understand, cause that that biologically, at some point, you know, when a man begins to get older, he ain't gonna find your ass no more attractive anyway. That's what I'm getting right? at, young boy. <laughs> and you're right. <laughs> young boy don't want the no old woman. Yeah. Trust me. Don't want no old woman. You know what they? You know what they want? You know what they want? They want some. They want some. 
They want somewhere to stay and somewhere to fuck their side chick while you at work. Yeah, they ain't gonna know you are. Hold on, you guys. Ain't no that ain't no nigga when you get on the line. He ain't nobody that you take home and try to wait. That's not what you're doing with him. You're not giving him your car. You're not doing that. Get that nigga like a few dollars. You know what I'm saying? Sugar mama status. Get the fuck out. Ain't no motherfucker coming in the house and sitting there making dinner up, running around your neck. No motherfucker doing that. Nobody's on that shit. Like, you already in a hole. You married. Like, what happened there? If I got a whole ass nigga up in there, I'm like, yo, let dip. Like, doing this shit. No nigga, you can't use my car. You should get one bus pass. What's up? Uber, call me. If he putting that young dick and tongue on you, you giving him the key. Who the hell? Who the hell? Who the hell? Exactly. You, you put the old young stiff one on you, then it's old with fucking. I know you fucking like. <laughs> exactly. She, I yeah. know you fucking like. That's the. He got all that energy. He got all that energy for you. He got all that energy for you. Old with for you. So you said that now. Yeah, I'm just gonna, you know, give him his few dollars, and he's gonna be on by his way. So when you put the old. I'm just saying, I'm gonna be like set sixty or seventy years old, whatever. Oh, yeah. You gonna say like, what else am I gonna be digging for? Like you're sixty, seventy years old. He's glad. And then you know, my husband and the whoever I'm with is gonna be that age too. So he probably ain't even getting it up no more. Like what the fuck? Like he probably ain't getting it up. He probably ain't getting it up. Like you hungry and you never. And this is now only like fucking weed. That's all they see, like. You probably ain't getting it up with you, but he get it up. Get it up with you. Damn, the shade. Shit, yeah, because I know when I'm the standing there, yeah, I'm going to be like that. I'm going to say this is hypothetical. Yeah, I'm going to say it. Like, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> to my doctor's appointment. I'm going to my social security check in my pocket. <laughs> Get up on that. Okay, I bet you laugh. Oh, you think I'm you think. Okay. Listen, same blood run through all of our veins in here, so you think well, okay. See, <laughs> okay. You won't so, see me. So you gotta keep in mind, cuz she, she's always talking about statistics and probability and shit. So when you look at the ratio from men to women, you know, you got you got you got a, a, a woman out here turning 18 every day. Being these guys, you what know, you saying? I can't get no bitch huh? that's turning 18 too because hoes like money too. No, nah, I'm just saying, you know, <laughs> the fuck, anybody. Yeah. Listen, true, true, listen, true. listen, listen, uh, we'll both be with our bitches to the social security <laughs> office. Like, what you gonna take your car? <laughs> you know, let's just get around, baby. Fuck you, yeah, baby. Like, it's 2018 around this bitch. But Trust what, me. what's more likely to be attracted? So, a woman being attracted money. to money. Money. Or a man being Niggas attracted like to a, like a wrinkle ass woman. So but I have a money. Money. I'll take the money for I'll take the money for two thousand. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It gets shit done. Thank you. 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 Thank I bet you ain't never hired that shit for that shit. Cause these lights out, baby. You, yeah. just, you see, you see a boomerang with Eddie right Murphy has the Eddie Murphy has the fuck Earth the kid. Yeah. He yeah. said, just cut the lights off. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Listen, this shit like I'm aged perfectly. The fuck, like shit. As long as they coming out with new shit every day. So okay, I got to say, do you love me? Let's drink. So, 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 all uh, y'all three. In agreement with uh, no relationships, no marriage. No, no, I, I believe that you know, you, you know, you obviously you know you want someone who will be by your side, but beyond sex, right? Because once I, what you going to be? You know, I, I need, sex. if I'm gonna get married, then you know, I, I need somebody who gonna, who gonna come rub my motherfucking back, you know, with, back. when when I can't move around. You follow me? I exactly. You know, you know, you know be able to escort me to the to the to the Just motherfucking squirt. bathroom, right? And change yeah, my yeah, or something. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. I get to see it. What the fuck? Well, how do you a, think a, a random motherfucker? I, I, I don't think a random motherfucker. I don't think a random motherfucker. I don't think a random motherfucker. I know everybody in my shit. We yeah. orgies if I want to. What makes you think that you can't? Yeah. Captain, I don't think a random motherfucker gonna be that inclined to just <laughs> become in a change of the pins and shit. It, it's but gonna take. It's gonna I'm take. I'm him and not me. That's what I'm trying to No, I'm just saying. That's what I'm talking Because about. you were just talking about it. That listen, I'm trying to tell you why him and not me. But I'm saying you said you're gonna be able to find some motherfucker with your money. I could. I could and nothing wrong with my personality and who I am. They're gonna like, steal that, your because, check and disappear. And that's why that was, if I was had a chicken daddy, that's what I would be doing to him. What's the difference between me so, so, and a nigga? 
So, like, why can't I have that, but he can? Well, what the fuck? He just said he's looking for somebody to marry to do that. Okay, but I can't marry my little sugar mama. So, if I'm like, you know, I plan on having like at least three to four husbands. That'd be best to have my kid like seven. Because, of course, three to four husbands. husbands. Like, like the first one is a starter. You know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? That's what I'm saying at the top, like three is probably the top. Okay, man, go ahead and break this down to us, because I, I, like, I'm Like, following. at least three, at least three, probably the first one is always the start. That's how you, like, fill it out, see see what's compatible, see what's work. The second one, okay, you in love, or whatever, you know, whatever, whatever. But the third one is the turn, and that is the one that you usually end So on. you plan on being married three times so you find the right hook? I don't want to be married that time, but I'm going to give myself three times. This is, I'm going to be realistic. You gotta find the right one, somebody's compatible. Shit, well, everybody. What's the right one? What do you mean, the right one? Whoever what you are mean? compatible with. What if that takes up to number five? If you're not sure what you want, then what the fuck is this? What if that for? takes up to number five, though? Like, damn, well, shit, listen. I don't know. Like, I don't, I'm hoping I'll be very five times. I don't think anybody should be married five fucking times. I wouldn't bet nobody out on. What was, what's has been your longest relationship? Eight years. Eight years? Okay. You probably you probably could get one more guy. <laughs> it just be that mad. Over with fun. Yeah. Oh. How yeah. the fuck? What makes you think that it's over with me? Eight years, that's a long one for the time. That was my last relationship. Like the next one probably will be longer. And now, you know, now that, you know, as, as I'm older now, I know what well, I want. Well, see, you still never define that right much. I just told you whoever you're compatible. If well, I said that, what does that mean? You're going to be, be compatible with the first two because you married them. You know, it's like, it's a honeymoon phase. And shit changes depending on how much you want to do. Well, you don't phase. marry the motherfuckers then. I mean, I don't have to, but if we talking about getting married is that uh, for a concept, I can't get married. You just want to have three weddings? No, not really. I don't want to eat this money. It's like, <laughs> like, 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 like that's a lot of money. That's stupid here. That's stupid. Hey, I don't ball us in this room. Diana's going to get married first. Absolutely. Oh my God. What? To a young boy. What devil worship you guys? <laughs> okay, well, there you have it. Relationships, uh, I guess they still exist. Situationships, they still out here too. And uh, Diana just, Diana just want the penis. <laughs> so, so, so if y'all got any questions for us, that email is below. Diana, Catherine, Derek. That's right. Send those questions. We out. <laughs> from Through the Hard Way TV. Go like our fan page on Facebook. Also subscribe to the YouTube. Don't forget to like and share this video. Comment under the link. It's your boy, Real. Shout out to all our fans that love Thank us. We love you too. And shout out to my motherfucking haters. haters. Hey, I love you motherfuckers, okay? And I know y'all see the ladies looking good in them Through the Hard Way TV hey. shirts. <laughs> the hard way, T. Yeah. <laughs> I got a man. You got a man. We got a man. Well, what? Who bad? 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 Y'all hit that subscribe button for y'all chance to win official three to hallway TV gear. I don't know if y'all gonna be able to make those shirts look as good as the ladies got them looking. Uh, <laughs>